the Education Administration menu gives you a high-level overview of the education status of your organization. From here, you can look at many different dynamics of the educational compliance. On the first page, the overview, you have the ability to filter down the result set by user role, color codes, shift letters, skills, etc. This will draw a graph of your red, yellow, green education compliance for each user. The education section of IOPS 360 is divided into requirements based on their user role. Each user can have one or more user roles. We can click on those to see the assignments out here, the quantity of staff that have that user role, the number of licenses required, the number of classes, and the number of skills that are required for each of these. To assign the user role to staff members, you can do that from the user list, or you can do it from the portal as well, simply by clicking on an individual and changing their user roles. Again, the user role is the glue, the centerpiece of the educational requirements. Users can have multiple, and those requirements will get stacked. All medics must have ACLS, PALS, NRP. All supervisors must have RSI, crew chief class, etc. On the licenses tab, you can see what the license down for your organization is. You can also zoom in and look at an individual user and see their license for a specific type. Same with classes. You'll be able to see the class definitions, how long they're good for, and you can break it down by user to kind of aggregate when those are coming expired, when you may need to be putting on those classes. Skills will function a lot the same way. Skills also have attributes. This gives you some tools to modify those, analyze those, see the missing required items as well. Other education shows you the quantity of hours that the users have put in for other education. This is not required for their profile, just as a way to aggregate what they may be doing outside of the requirements and give you those analytics as well. The user details allows you to view additional details for each user. And the last tab is the classes in Con Ed class uh, that are upcoming for your organization. So if someone's missing some hours, this will show you if they have an educational opportunity to get that class, such as EBOC, that you might only offer once or twice a year.